Welcome, friends, to another edition of Tiffin Cast. I am with Jane Ammon, who is a child photographer based out of Pennsylvania. And Jane is going to be speaking at Inspire Photo Retreats, a wonderful, wonderful conference for photographers. And I got to emphasize wonderful because you've got to go to check it out. And uh, Jane's was so inspired by receiving uh, emails from friends who who told her about Inspire and said, oh, we got to go, but she did one better. She applied to speak there. So Jane, thanks for joining me. Welcome to the show. Thank you. I want to step right into something that, that, that hits me the first time I go to your website, and you say you have a gift. I do. What is, what is that gift? Can you tell us about it? I am hearing impaired, so I consider that a gift. Um, for me, communication is a big part of everything I do. It's you know, it's what I have to do to focus on everything in my day life. In my daily life, I have to lean in and read lips and really pay attention. So that's when I realized when I started getting into photography, to realize that the reason that I connect with kids so much is that's how kids communicate. And so they like me so much because my face is so expressive um, and I don't have to use a lot of words to get across what I want to do with them when I'm photographing them. So um, I just realized that it was a gift and turned it into my art and pretty much has taken off since then. Wonderful. Uh, I know you've been uh, featured by Mira Ko, right? Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. And, you've, and that, may have, uh, that may have inspired you to do even more work in the, in the same genre, mm -hmm. right? Absolutely. Yeah, Mira was one of the first people. She was one of the first classes I ever took, and she is still, I consider her a dear friend, and she is just a huge inspiration for me. So, How, how has learning from her uh, inspired you to be a speaker, though? Because I know she speaks a lot as well, mm -hmm. and how, how is that, has that segued into what you do now? Oh, absolutely. I think that um, when I took her confidence workshop, that was probably about, it was over four years ago, um, I remember saying to her, you know, I had taught, I was actually, my background is I'm a speech therapist, so I did speech therapy for 13 years, so I still have a teacher's heart, even though I'm a photographer now, and I remember saying to her, I have to find a way that I can't give up teaching, but I can still do what I love, and she said, oh, well, then you should do, you know, conferences and speak, and I said, oh, I don't think so, but here I am, so now I'm doing exactly what she said I should do. So. Lovely, that's great. Tell us a little bit about what you're planning on presenting at Inspire. What, Absolutely. What, what can we, what can we what can we, uh, I guess, tease out of you? Um, I am going to talk to photographers on how to photograph kids. You know, so many people, when I tell them I'm a child photographer, I hear, oh, okay, good luck with that. They say, no, 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 there's an art to the madness, you know. Um, really talking about how to use a lot less language when you're photographing kids and using um, different strategies that I actually used when I was teaching that work really well with kids to get them to listen to what you want them to do. Um, you know, I can give you a really quick one. One of my favorite things I do with kids is I call it the first then strategy. Like first we're going to do this, then we give that. And they then think that they're in control even though you're really in control when you use that strategy. So those are some of the things that I'm going to give photographers. Because even wedding photographers, you need that when there's kids in the wedding. You need different strategies to use with them. So those are the things I'm going to talk about is how to get them to listen to what you want to do. Excellent. But yet still let them feel like they're in control and not losing them. Wonderful. Wonderful. That's great. Well, I'm already inspired to, to be at, at your presentation for sure uh, because I photograph kids as well. And uh, it's, it is challenging, uh, as most, most photographers will tell you, because their attention spans are so short. And yeah. you've got you've to be able to, to get in there and photograph them. Mm -hmm. um, in a way yeah. that's in a way that's natural to them, you know, right? Yeah, they so. really truly, and that's you know part of my message is that I believe every child can be heard. They really truly want to feel like you're listening to them and that they're being heard. And if you give them that confidence that they are, then you know they're they can become petty in your hands. You just have to to work them that way. Awesome. So. Great. Thank you so much, Jane. Uh, you're gonna uh, folks. You're gonna you're gonna hear and watch Jane work the room. Uh, at Inspire Photo Retreats, and I can't wait to meet you, Jane. Uh, thank you so I'm much excited. for joining me today. Awesome. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see everybody. Take care. Bye.